This video will show you how to carry out a procedure for a transfer set change according to the Manitoba Renal Program Policy and Procedure using the guidelines for 2017. We will begin by preparing the equipment. You must wash your hands according to hospital policy. Then you will gather your supplies. You will need a peritoneal dressing tray, 10% povidone iodine solution, two packages of 10 by 10 centimeter sterile gauze, sterile gloves, a Baxter transfer set, two mini caps, one 3cc syringe, one vial of 0.9% sodium chloride, an alcohol swab, and a blunt fill needle. First, you will open your tray. Then, you will add povidone iodine, a 3cc syringe, a blunt filled needle, two sterile gauze, and a Baxter transfer set. Then you will wipe the top of the sodium chloride vial with an alcohol swab. Then you will perform hand hygiene and put on the sterile gloves. You will take a sterile gauze and draw up 3 cc's of normal saline. You will use this gauze to maintain the sterility of your gloves. Then you will remove the sterility cap from the dark blue end of the Baxter transfer set and lure lock the syringe onto the transfer set. Then you will prime the transfer set. Then you will close the twist clamp on the transfer set. You will pick up the catheter with a sterile gauze and place the sterile drape underneath the connection. You will want to maintain the sterility of your gloves. Then you will take a gauze moistened in povidone iodine and you will scrub the connection for 30 seconds. Then you will take another gauze moistened with povidone iodine and you will wrap it around the connection site for one and a half minutes. You will need a total contact time of povidone iodine with the connection site of two minutes. 30 seconds for scrubbing and one and a half minutes contact time with the gauze. Then you will take another gauze moistened with povidone iodine and you will scrub from the titanium to halfway down to the base of the catheter. Then you will take a sterile gauze and place it underneath the connection. You will remove the wet povidone iodine gauze and lay it down to dry. It must dry completely. Fold the new gauze around the connection site and clamp the catheter with the clamp from the dressing tray. You will want to be sure that there is a gauze between the clamp and the catheter. Then you will take a sterile gauze and remove the old transfer set. Then you will want to take the new transfer set and remove the sterility cover and thread the new transfer set 
onto the titanium. Ensure that it is threaded correctly and that it is tight. You now have a new transfer set. Be sure to anchor your transfer set securely so it's not being tugged on or pulled on. Ensure that you document the date of the transfer set change in the patient health record and CARDEX. Also, document the reason for change.